Oh no. What? How? Oh. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, it seems odd to me. How did we mismeasure okay. this? Uh, what's wrong? Uh, mm, mm. Okay, I, oh, I it put... Goes, okay, you didn't put the engine in. The engine is at the end of the blue blocks. Yeah. I mismeasured. I'm gonna. That's, I'm gonna. That's why build I the, put the blue blocks there. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna rebuild the ramps from the opposite side. I think that'll yeah. maybe make my life a little bit oh, easier. Totally. That. That probably do it. Okay. I guess I should probably make sure I have. Okay. So this goes with this ramp. It's with this ramp. Ah. Uh, oh, crap. I accidentally put it on defaults for color, and I've lost that really nice uh, purple color. Well, there's no way to copy a color, is there? That you're looking at? I guess I'm just gonna have to guess it. Nope. Gu guessing at what? I, I got rid of my, my pinky purple that I've been using for this ship for this entire time. Actually, Ooh, I could probably... Ah, okay. <sighs> eh, whatever. It's fine. It'll... It'll just be the wrong color for a while. What? Oh. Huh. Okay. I, I see, so matches. then you start the... Okay, then you start the slanted blocks. Yeah, I can do the we'll slants if you want to keep filling in. All right, I'll fill it in. Um, let's see. Let's see. Oh, control P materials? is color picker. Well, wait, control P is color picker. Wait. I'm not... No, P is color picker, period. Alright. How do I... There is a color picker. I had that wrong. Okay, let's... I really wish the, uh... Oh, shift P. There we go. That's it. Okay, shift, shift P is color picker if you ever mess this up. Okay. okay, that is that is really encour encouraging because I really did want to go. lose you that hue of purple. And right, it would be hard to replicate, and then if it's just off by even a little bit, it's yep. an eyesore. Yeah, I don't want to mess this <laughs> up too much. This is a lot of work, and having to repaint the entire thing is going to be awful. Awful. <laughs> okay. Big ship. Impressive. Sad thing is, a lot of people do a hell of a lot bigger than this, and I'm like, I just want enough to sure. fly around, <laughs> and instead of having Batbeard just off scouting for resources, it's all of us. Right. And then we just... I'm actually surprised that we got this far, and... Out of materials. What am I gonna oh, do now? I Should I fly something in and dismantle it? Uh, oh, do you need... need do you need more steel? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, give me a second. Um, you know, I'm just gonna cut this. No, I'm not gonna cut the gun off. I don't know how much ammo is in it, and I can't. Okay, I'm just turning off the Gatling turret. Okay. Okay. You want heavy armor block? Okay. I see. Somebody said you could do like a 3x3 three three block placement at some point, but I've never been able to figure that one out. Maybe that was for a different game, though. Huh. Can't imagine what game that would be for. Yeah, I don't remember. Well, one way or another, this should be more than enough steel. And remember, there should also be some in the, uh... Uh, there should it, also be some... kinda dry... at the moment. 
Well, you can also tell the refinery to make some more. Okay. I'll, I'll go ahead and do that. Oops. Refinery. So do you watch movies much, or what do you do when you're not a uh, slave to our whims? Well, actually, I'm uh, getting back in. I mentioned the gym earlier tonight. Uh, ah. I'm getting back into that. I, At one point in time in the last two years, I wanted to be a powerlifter and actually compete in powerlifting, and I got really big, and uh, it's just been hard to maintain with prioritizing YouTube as as potentially, you know, work. Yes. Um, no, I know that so one. So, I slacked off. I, I went down to, like, two workouts per week. And now I, I'm just getting back into the six-day schedule that's really good for building strength. And, um, you know, what's nice with that is that you rotate between the three muscle groups, legs, uh, back, and chest. And, uh... You know, it's it's just it's nice to, to get back into that because you sleep better, you feel better, and uh, yeah, you know, who can say no to like a 300 pound bench press? So, I think my max on bench press was 200 once. I was like, Ugh. that's actually really good. Yeah, I did a lot of lifting in uh in college because we had a gym that uh -huh. was like literally seconds from um. Like literally seconds from my my dorm, and I was in the dorms for probably uh -huh. longer than I should have been. But whatever. Uh, but it was so easy to work out. And then all my gym buddies got like really busy and then fat, so like it was pretty uh -huh. much there was no coming back for any of them. And I was just like, well, I guess I'm just here by myself then. <laughs> yeah. And that, that's kind of rough. I uh, I usually meet a bunch of new people if, if I don't know anybody own. that's there. You know, it's I guess it I'm just kind of sucks to be there and not know anybody and just go about your business and then leave. I'm kind of an antisocial gym person. I just okay. turn on my my MP3 player and go. Uh, part of it uh -huh. is like you know this job is such a social thing. It's like ha meeting more people you don't than need I would anymore. have. <laughs> yeah, meeting people that actually require me to, like, do social events, it, oh, it, that would be so stressful. Uh -huh. Um, let's see, Shell's, Shell's family, back when we lived in New York, would show up every once in a while and be like, hey, you should, you might want to work on this from the underside, I'm currently filling, the, filling in the top real fast. Oh, okay, I'll try doing that. Sorry for evicting you. Um, yeah, that's fine. But, uh... So they'd be like, hey, we should eat out. And I'm like, I have, I have like, stream stuff I need to do. Uh -huh. And, you know, yeah. normal normal people don't do these things, but right. I do. And it's it's weird. And so, like, the, the idea of having friends that are like, hey, let's hang out on Friday night. And I'm like, I have work then. But yeah, also, I'm actually, I'm surprised that I was able to go to those movies with my friends uh, a month ago. It's just... You know, I, I want to do this. I want to be here for all of these things. And if I'm not, yep. you know, if I'm not in it, I, I want to watch and I want to I want to edit, you know, while I'm watching. Yep. <laughs> Get things done. It's it's okay. fun to to add to the YouTube playlists and everything constantly. And I don't know. It, it's been it's been actually hard for me to to keep from overworking and yeah i'm not a i'm yeah. not a good person to talk to about that <laughs> really no definitely not, not uh, mr nine videos a day <laughs> yeah i do more than that if i can which is bad yeah. <laughs> okay no energy where do i pick my uh, bay yeah, Med Bay. Med Bay gets you more. Okay. So you're on creative mode, is that right? Yes. Yeah, that explains a few things. Yeah. I I will switch back to non-creative mode when we're not laying down the framework for it, but right now it's just kind of framework time, so I don't really feel like... Um, 
I, I don't really feel like uh, being mm -hmm. super slow. And unfortunately, I have no way of active, no way of knowing how to activate. Sure. Uh, sure. Not like creative mode for you or purple or whomever. Yeah. So well, it's just actually, like, well. it's um, if I hit the Alt F12 or Alt F10. Alt F10. It says admin menu is available when you're an admin, or when you yeah. get promoted to Space Master. So how do you promote to Space Master? Interesting question. Yeah. I'm guessing it's under I, factions, and so on. Maybe? Uh, let's see. Because what I was originally trying to do was uh, cycle characters, but I couldn't figure out how to do that. Yeah. Characters, biggest grid, fastest, no. Uh, I've got character control. I don't honestly know how Space Master works. <laughs> uh, maybe I can do players. Ah, Bapier, promote. Okay. Try it now. Is. All right, all you got F10, it? and I have it. Hey, okay. So that should speed okay. things up substantially. It, substantially, yeah. Okay, still don't entirely know how I'm laying out like half of this, but sure, we'll figure it out. So I mentioned movies. What's your favorite movie? Favorite of all time. It's very hard to figure out. Um, I gotta say, I'm I'm a real big fan of the Lord of the Rings movies. I mean, right. they're they're very satisfactory every time I watch them, and. I assume you mean the original trilogy. Uh, Are you a yeah. Hobbit fan? Not at all. I liked it um, enough as kind of like fan non-canon. Yeah, there's just a lot wrong with that. It was funnier. I'm not going to get into it. <laughs> hey, get into it. Get into it. Well, yeah, it's... Not? It's just, it, it seemed to me that, actually it seems to everybody who has a problem with the movies, that the studio is just grubbing for more Lord of the Rings, and so there was more conflict and fighting in every one of those movies than actually appeared in the books, and it's not yeah, I that, that, it's not that it needs to adhere to the books. To me, like, I don't care about exact continuity, but... What I care about is a good movie, and it was not. The pacing was awful, and it was too long, and it 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 was boring. It was boring, and um, you know, I'm just not that big enough of a fan for it to serve me that like like that. You know, I I watched all three of them, um, and I kind of wish I hadn't. I've only seen the first two. I'm like, okay. all right. My problem actually with the, uh, the oh, crap. I got the, I, I pressed the button right. And then I immediately uh. lost it like a dingus. All right, whatever. I actually liked the parts that everybody hated. And uh. I liked the parts that uh, I would say ruined the movie for people. Like the, um, I actually rather enjoyed the the mines, uh, the goblin mines, for example. I thought that was yeah, that was more interesting. I, I I totally agree. I thought that was actually rather fun to watch, which was really strange to me because I was like, you know, this realistically, as a Hobbit fan, this ruins the movie. Mm -hmm. However, yeah, I also yeah. am having a good time watching this. Um, Whereas, uh, in the, uh, second movie, I actually really liked the barrel scene, which, again, I would argue kind of ruins yeah. everything. But it was like, it, this is a legitimately fun scene that I enjoy watching. Right, right. And that's, that's what I mean about, like, continuity doesn't matter to me. It's, it's, it matters to me that they make a good movie. Uh, oh, this is, it's nice to be able to place these blocks down and have them instantly build. Yes. That's why I'm on this mode right now, even though it's like, eh. It's not quite 
what we should be doing for survival mode at the sure. same time. Oh, um, fuck. I think Actually, we I'm paid gonna, our dues. I'm going to cut game. the I'm going to cut the thrusters off. I don't know if we have enough uh, materials for the thrusters. Mainly it's just uh, I know we have enough uh, I know we have enough steel. Um I'm going to leave Oh, crap. Yeah. I, I accidentally didn't um didn't uh, add some things and it's uh, I, I had some pieces just floating off into space yeah the curse of the floating pieces yeah well ma mainly curse of did not connect everything else <laughs> because it's being really lazy okay there we go yeah I'll connect two of these the thing is I don't know if we have enough thruster components okay. um, and I actually did I build any of these before we went and no, we had no thrusters on this. Yeah, uh, so stuff like thrusters and whatnot, I actually Yeah, engineering, don't. yeah. Um, the only blocks I'm, I'm yeah. freely putting down are stuff that only require, um, uh, steel. that only require metal, uh, yeah. steel, because we have, uh, we have an infinite amount, it's just time consuming to yeah. do it the other way, but like thrusters, which require, what was it, 960 thruster components? No, we're gonna have to farm for that ourselves. Like, I want this thing... I kind of want this thing to be this, like, broken hulk that can't quite, uh, fly yet. And okay. so we're... I mean, you know, the, the point of it is, like, we definitely don't have enough resources to make six large thrusters on this thing, probably. Right. Or maybe we do, I have no idea. Uh, that's part of it. But I know we have an infinite number of steel, so it's just like... Yeah. It's, uh... I think we're waiting on silver to make more thruster parts. I don't know how many thruster and, parts uh, we have. We have a lot. I haven't been able to find any locally. Then again, I haven't explored much locally. I explored 200 kilometers away, which is... <laughs> I had no idea. How did I get out that far? I'm kind of impressed you made it that far. Yeah. Well, there's... There's a beacon out there, too. That I For think what? has since disappeared. If you press Alt, you should be able to see it at a distance. Let's see. Oh yeah, it is. It is kind of still there, isn't it? No, no, it's not. Yeah, so it was. It was glitching out, and it was telling me that you and Purple and Bird were all 200 kilometers away, and I, I went that direction, and ended up out there. Huh. Yeah. Weird. Well, it's not there anymore, so... Yeah. As I'm, I'm not sure. Is there anything I need to add to this now? Uh, not too much. We okay. still need some kind of bridge section. Like, some kind yeah. of bridgey lounge. If you want to... Hmm... I, I, I figure you could probably figure out some kind of bridgey lounge setup. Well, I need I need to look at the design. Do you still need again. it? Uh, where's, the, where's the link? Is it in Teamspeak? Yeah, it should be in Teamspeak still. Okay, I'll take a look at that. Okay. that the right link uh here i'll it's... i'll put it back it's it's not the most recent one okay i'll put up a new one there you go thank you okay that's the one i'm gonna right, see if so i can find one that shows be... the bottom a little bit better but honestly oh, it's I'd... right okay i see where it is um so if we're gonna follow that it would be Right here, uh, on this level, if you can see this. Okay, one second. I just want to see if I can find, like, an underside for this sucker. There's not... There's no, like, sort of bottomy-looking parts for this. Hmm. That's really strange, actually. Yeah, I'm everybody just shows, it. like, the top. Oh, it doesn't show the underneath? 
Yeah, no, there's not a single um, picture of the bottom side, really. Looking at it, though, it kind of looks like it's a bowl-type shape uh, right about here. Okay, let me, let me just... see where you are, because I'm currently just staring at the bottom. Okay. okay. So I would, I would round off the edge uh, here and start a bowl shape. And it's kind of, I'm gonna guess it's a little oblong. Yeah, unfortunately, we can't really do oblong, so I'm just gonna start sloping it. <laughs> it, it I'm just gonna yeah. have it slope up. Yeah, I think that would do it. And we'll just have it work. Yeah, it, yep. the wings weren't uh, gonna be curved either. There's pretty much sure, nothing we could sure. do about that. Yeah. Well, I mean, you can you can approximate some of it with slants, but not much. And it's probably not worth the time. Yeah. I did a little so, bit here and there, but I, I think for the most part, we're just going to go for an same. angular version. And call it a day. There we go. Look how the textures merge together in this one. Scrap mechanic doesn't really do that do it that well. Uh-huh. You know the locks oh, yeah. together. Yeah. Cause well, this one has like lines and textures that kinda yeah. slowly put together and it generally looks quite nice. Yeah, scrap mechanic doesn't do that at all yet. They're kind of textureless textureless blocks. Well, actually, you're probably thinking of a lot of the like mod blocks. But like, uh -huh. um, uh, what's well, a good example? Well, the wood, the wood yeah. does that. Yeah. And I, no, the the metal is a repeating pattern. Um, yeah, but it's like not a good repeating pattern. Right. This is actually, you know, the patterns interlink, and both yeah. blocks will actually modify themselves to link together, which is cool. I like when games do that. I'm trying to think of another game that did that very well. Actually, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, of all things, did that very well. Pretty much all the pieces that you could link together, paths and so on. I almost um, never played any of... Like, I don't think I've really played it? a whole lot of... No. I was a oh, man, Roller Coaster Tycoon... I was a Tycoon 2 kid, and that was pretty much it. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I played... Oddly enough, I didn't get to play Tycoon 2 because I was still very satisfied playing Roller Coaster Tycoon. And then I was just waited for 3 to come out, and I bought that when it was new. Um, my computer couldn't handle it, but I didn't care. I played it over Thanksgiving break and enjoyed it. And um, I've just been a, a fan of that ever since, except for the newest one, which is very disappointing. Or to the um, fact that they haven't given it to you yet. <laughs> well, that's that's Planet Coaster. That's a different oh, there's... one. I'm disappointed oh, in that for not being able to play it because that's the good one. Yeah, you're talking uh, about Roller Coaster Tycoon World. I forgot World about that. World is awful. That just does not look fun to me. Uh, it just looks like sad times. Yeah, yeah. I was talking to uh, <laughs> uh, Blitz Kriegsler and Dragast about yeah. it, and they're just like, eh, and I was like, okay. That's okay. enough for me. That's all I need. Because, I don't know. I'd rather play those games when they're complete and not crap. Which is, I guess... Hmm. Not today. Not, not today. today. I'll oh. live. Just saying. There we go. God damn it. Uh, I have the worst luck putting some of these ramps down. I like... You know how you can use the scroll wheel? To get them to, um... To switch types? Kinda? Mm -hmm. Uh, sometimes it doesn't, like, um... It doesn't scroll properly and it sucks. Sure. Uh, well, it, it, like, resets the rotation. I'm like, no, 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 no. I, I needed that. 
Yeah. Oh, I, I do hate it when a game uh, does that. It's like it's deliberately trying to spite me. Okay. See if we can get some stairs down here. So we've done favorite movie. Uh, you got a favorite game? Um, yeah, if I think about it for a second. Seconds I mean, obviously, up. I obviously I like Batman. Uh, I am in love with the Batman games because they make me feel uh, effective and powerful at fighting crime. Um, but they're not, I don't think they're exactly my favorite game. And Kerbal Space Program comes very close, but it's not something that I completely fanned out on. You know, I and I haven't played uh, Kerbal yet. Bird and I were gonna pick it up, and then I totally forgot. I'll probably pick it up the next time it goes on sale or something. It's it's worth it, and and the fan base is there. Wow, I placed these stairs like a cheese grater. <laughs> uh, do these not snap? They must. Um. So anyway, yeah, I, I want to say. Kerbal, but actually the last game that I, I really uh, like when I'm going out and, and, I'm, and I'm eating or I'm doing anything else I can't stop thinking about the game well um, Warframe did that to me uh, six months ago and actually it's more than six months it's about eight to ten months ago when I started playing and uh, oh there we go we got him to snap yeah, Warframe really, really got me to, to love it for a while. Um, but, like, a game that I would play over and over again, I, I'd really have to think about it, because I, I don't take that question lightly. I actually always get mad at people that when they ask me my favorite game, I'm like, uh -huh. I no, I've played like, <laughs> I've, got, I've got like 2,000 games by the, well, no, a little over 1,000 games by this point. It's like, yeah. how do you judge I've got, that? I've got about 300, you know, and it, it's it's hard for me to tell. I mean, the, the games that I really would say had favoritism uh, were the games that I grew up with, and... Uh, the first games that I would be allowed to play were um, Age of Empires, the strategy games. Oh, uh, I hated Age one, of Empires. Two, and I three. could never get into it. Well, I, I got into it because my, my mom saw it as a semi-educational game, uh, you know, with all the history that it, it tried to teach you. But it's pseudo-history, you know, it's not even accurate. <laughs> yeah, close enough. But, uh, yeah, it is kind of close enough. It makes you aware of, of the region and some of the conflicts in those regions of geography. But, um, so yeah, I played the heck out of those, and then I played, uh, Star Wars Battlefront 2. Oh, that was, a couple years. that was such a good game. Yeah. And I'd say that, that those games are definitely my favorites, you know? It's just, I can't replace, the, the time I spent, you know, just with those games, Far exceed any any time I would ever spend with any other game, uh, probably for the rest of my life. So, yeah, I think I think a double staircase, as as much space as it takes, it's just you know we're building a bridge for this. You kind of need a double wide. Okay. It looks good. Oh. So. Although I don't know how to enclose the bridge exactly. I think you're gonna want to do that. All right, I'll take a look in a second. There's okay. probably a fair number of glass blocks that we have access to. And then this front bit, I'm gonna probably like shore up, but it's gonna be uh, open space for weapons, I'm thinking. The thing is, I kind of don't want this thing to be terribly, uh... Terribly powerful? 
I don't want this thing to be a total gun deck. I just want something that we can, um... Uh -huh. We can fly around in. And then we have fighters. Like, currently I've got the universe set to pretty peaceful. And it'd sure. be... I'd, I would rather have enough space for all of our shenanigans than... Oh yeah, that looks nice. I'd rather have space for our shenanigans than... Oh, okay, good. There's there's actually <laughs> an entrance here. Uh, Anything? Okay, I'll be up in a second. Sure, yeah. I'm almost out of oxygen, so I'm like, I should probably go <laughs> fix this. Yeah, I'm surprised at how oxygen and energy drains. Yeah, it'd be really nice if there was, like, actual functional upgrades that you could do on the character. It's like, I would like to have a bigger oxygen pack and energy and whatnot. Okay. Uh, By the way, do, uh, do shift... Down? Do shift P. Uh -huh. Um... To copy the exact color I'm pulling from. Oh! Is that so? Yes. I didn't know that worked. Yep, shift P. Okay. Uh, we'll copy the... copy the color. Let and me, that way, every, uh, go ahead every and... block you work with. Uh... Shh, hold on. Hmm. Why is it not copying? Uh, oh, I have to have color out. There we go. I got it. Excellent. I will go ahead and fix all of these then. Yep. Currently scanning the ship to see if there's any of the wrong type of color. Looks like huh. you got quite a few of it. I think we yep. honestly made this thing too Star destroyer <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm looking you know, at it now it and I'm just like... I don't know if this is quite what we're looking for in terms of, um... But what else were we gonna do? Yeah, there's not really much we can <laughs> do, because there's no, um... There's no easy way to get it pointed out otherwise. Hmm. Well, whatever. I'll just pull it forward a bit, and then we'll have... Phalanges. Uh -huh. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm just looking at the diagram and it's like, it f uh, Well, if, uh, if you no. extended the front and no, then I see how I can out. do it. Um, so okay. the problem is I have it pointing towards the front and uh -huh. I can't I shouldn't do that. I need to have like at the midpoint here to yeah, have it point towards the ship towards the middle. I I more or less need to have it start uh curving outwards instead. Uh okay. cuz this thing has like a really wide wingspan comparatively. Well, I'm glad I'm getting this all done before we get in. Cuz like if you look at the diagram, like that uh, shit's pretty wide. Oh crap. Well, there goes Yeah. And if you look at ours, it's straight up Star Destroyer. Uh, no mistake. Yeah. Which means, eh. Okay. Um. Which means, I'm probably gonna actually reverse all of my block setup I have, so that they're pointing the other direction. Cause, you know, it's kind of like a tapering system. The underside I can keep as is. But all these wingtips are going to have to go, and I'm going to have to make it a fair bit longer. All right. Well, here we are. This is actually the kind of thing that it's like, maybe I should do this part off camera and get the actual, like, uh, total infrastructure uh -huh. complete. Well, you could still do this on camera. It's just you put a little time lapse on it when... I hate time lapse. You hate it? <laughs> um, it, it's kind of one of those where it's like I don't have the time for time lapses, so it's like doing uh -huh. a time lapse is like only because <laughs> I really messed up. 
Really? Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah no, I don't. I, I, I oh. like them. <laughs> I've noticed. I like actually, them. I actually saw a number of your time lapses. I think I told you just like turn down the music because they were a bit loud or something like I that. I don't recall. Maybe I, don't I didn't. I don't remember. Anything. Maybe I, maybe I was gonna say it, but uh, maybe I was just thinking at the time. I don't remember. It doesn't matter. I understand. I understand that they can be a bit loud, but uh, yeah, I always put you on know, like I, really. I do. I do quiet ones, and then. I'm like, well, everybody is too chicken, I'll say, instead of that uh, damn... Uh, anyway, uh, everybody's just too chicken to play the music at, I think, the appropriate volume. And, <laughs> you know, I, I don't want you to have my voice that loud anyway. So you can just turn it down. That's you know? Yeah. And I also, I also hate it when... The editor will edit it so low that I can't turn it up, you know? Or if I turn it up, it makes the voice so loud that I can't enjoy the music. So, I, I don't know. I, it's I guess a hard I thing. haven't figured it out, but it's a hard thing to really say you know the definite answer. Yes. It's very difficult to balance. Okay. Is this how I want it to be? Probably. So that's not gonna work. Let's see. No, it's the opposite. Damn it. Oh, it does go to the back there. It goes to all the way to the end, which means I need to just build the floor out. Okay. This? No, that's curving the wrong way. I really wish there was... Oh, shit. You know what I just remembered? Huh? We're... This is really stupid. There's a, um... There's mirror mode. Uh-huh. I totally forgot we had mirror mode. Wait, we... Oh, that would have helped. <laughs> yeah, that would have been real nice. I don't remember how to do that. Can you uh, copy from one half to the other? Um, I think no. so. No, I, I, I remember seeing some space engineers I'm a gameplay. Bit, I'm a little bit worried about that one way or another. Uh -huh. Okay. And my health is low <sighs> because of oxygen. So, somebody in chat actually. Okay. Is it N? Didn't I watch chat earlier? This one guy spammed mirror mode for like 20 minutes before he said I'm crying and left. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> I feel bad for anybody watching this. Well, also was not thinking. Well, whatever. Okay, how do we do it? Yeah, no, when I, oh god, when I'm building something, is it N? N? I'm pressing N, but it's not doing anything. I wanna cry now. Yeah, no, uh, when, I'm, <laughs> when I'm in a building game, I actively and mm. completely shut down to like, anything like I can respond to a conversation hence why like I ask questions or I can make like dumb jokes I cannot read chat for the life of me it's kind of the worst I feel really bad about it especially when it's moving by kind of quickly I I didn't notice it myself yeah I wasn't I wasn't paying attention it's totally my I, fault for not either 
Okay. Well. Problem is now I don't know how to get it working. Uh, that's kind of equally bad. Well, whatever. I'll get it working. What's your least favorite game? Oh, that's easy. Um, so it came it came in a pack of a bunch of other games during its Steam sale, but I uh, happened to get in that pack Kane and Lynch to uh, Dead Dog Men days? and oh. Dog Days or whatever. Yeah, I, Both, I know what you're talking but, about. But Dog Days had, at the time of its release, this sort of um, reputation for being the worst piece of shit that ever uh, came out. And so I was just curious, you know, I was I didn't care about playing the game. I didn't buy it for that game. I got uh, Supreme Commander and a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, oh, yeah, <laughs> the, uh, the THQ <laughs> uh, oh, panic bundle man. or something like that. <laughs> Man, that game is bad. <laughs> oh, it was oh, the yeah. worst. I can't believe I played it. Um, <laughs> but I'm, I'm kind of glad I did because it's so funny how awful it is. And it's just kind of one of those things, you know, it, can you uh, stomach uh, ghost chili pepper or can you do this or that or... It's just, you know, can I survive playing this game? <laughs> and I did all the way through. <laughs> and I I didn't want to finish it, but I was like, well, I got this far. <laughs> and it's not that long either. Um, but that is that is the worst game of all time. Okay, how do I how do I actually get the symmetry mode to work? So M is definitely, um... Uh -huh. M is how symmetry mode works. Press M, flick mode. What about left click to put it... Oh. And then N to activate. Okay. Uh, I'm wondering how nope. this is gonna... Oh, there we go. Now I got it. There you hey, go. Hey, mirror mode. It does work. Yeah. Okay. Um. Well, I'm a mean? dumbass, but I, I, I guess it's working now. So we'll go from here. People are, people are sad. Yeah, people should be sad. I definitely, I definitely doofled. I guess we'll find out later what happens. Uh, but I'm cloning the inside as much as I can. And, of course, the symmetry mode will pick up whatever I miss. Yeah, we can always take off symmetry mode for some of that stuff. I think it's fine. Um, but there's this... Is this oh, you got this going too on. Too wide? Maybe not. Alright, I need to do that. That's easy. We might want to move the... No. I'll just cut off part of the bottom, I think. That's a good idea. Uh, what I was originally gonna do, I, I think we'll have the wings three wide. Um, that way we can fit stuff through them, like, um, like, actually practically anything. And that'll make life a fair bit easier, so let's make sure. Make sure this works. No idea if that works. Well, I guess we're here, so I'm just gonna start slamming down a ton of blocks and we'll cut it up as needed. Because, yeah, the last time... Uh, mm. The last time I did this, I had, it, I had it be way too narrow. And that wasn't a really good-looking ship. 
So what I'm gonna try and well, it do does is have... look good. It, like it looks good, but the problem is um what we need is something closer to Okay. Uh we want it to be a wide wedge, not a shallow wedge, which is what we had earlier. If that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. And then I don't know what we'll do with the front or a lot of this other stuff. But I'll probably this will still save me a ton of time, so I don't I guess I don't mind as much anymore. Okay. You know, looking at this now, the base uh -huh. needs to be, the base needs to be deeper. <laughs> I, I'm very yeah, drop, finicky. Drop the base. Yeah, I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna raise the top. <laughs> raise the roof. There raise the go. roof and drop the yeah. base. Okay. So cut that off, add a whole slew of blocks to the top. So that means your bridge system is probably going to have to get moved up or something. Yeah, let's move it up. Because uh, currently I'm just going to be covering it in blocks that are now floating in space. That was that was not a that was not a great. Is that all right, or should I move the stairs back? Uh, stairs are probably fine. I'm okay. not entirely sure yet. Okay, so you said you got really hooked on Warframe. Uh, what did it? Friend, or you just saw it? Oh, like, it was yeah, sure. it, was, it was friends. They, uh, it's it's my brother-in-law Dave and uh, his friend Nick, and uh, they they were you know just kind of carrying me along to any of the games that they wanted to play at the time. That works. And um, I yeah, that all and the they, time. They, they got me into Warframe and. I ended up just like playing it solo for days and days, grinding my way up, and uh, it was it was interesting when you know I'd only played for a week and I was already more than their mastery rank. <laughs> They've been playing it for a couple of years. They played it in in the beta, even, and Nick has some of the uh, rewards for that, but he didn't get his hands on. Um, Excalibur, Excalibur Prime, Prime. Yeah, and he's so he's so sour about that. <laughs> I don't know. Even with the recent changes, I've never ever once wanted Excalibur uh -huh. Prime. Okay, uh, so I'm doing yeah. another redesign here. So the problem ultimately with this thing is it needs to flare out. Yes. Kind of at the at a midway point, so like right here-ish, mm -hmm. probably. So maybe what if I do this? There you go. Now, I still haven't figured out how to make the blocks do that. Uh, have you used the scroll wheel? Scroll wheel, okay. That, that explains a lot. So thank you. Yeah, the... <laughs> I think we were discussing that, that once it. or twice. But yeah, yeah, scroll wheel is how you get the alternate parts. Okay. I wasn't really paying attention to your conversations there. I mean, I was trying, but I, it didn't make much sense since I didn't have context for it. Yeah. Um, that's always fair. What? Hmm. But that's actually the primary reason why I don't say much is that I don't want to interrupt and uh, if I do interrupt it's only because of you know I have a joke that I actually believe in which isn't often <laughs> but uh... <laughs> that's the trick for humor you just commit to bad bad humor and eventually it gets better <laughs> yeah if bird and I are any any indication we Ugh. Early days wander humor. Not actually good. <laughs> hmm. I, I, I don't I don't know if I want to find that out for myself. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I actually have like a, a good metric for that either. Just like the er the early days were 
trying to solo commentary is hard. I, I think part of it is I wasn't making jokes back in the back in the day, so that's. Oh, you weren't trying to be funny. Uh, like for Gmod, I probably was. Collabs, so like you were I was doing like serious commentary. Pretty serious commentary, yeah. Okay. I I get that. This is really. Hmm. Okay, so I got this. Well, it's kind of working. In hell. Okay. Let's try. I'm just trying to get like a happy medium between. these, like, ramp blocks that I keep putting down. I don't want this thing uh -huh. to get, like, really wide, because it looks kind of stupid otherwise. You know, come to think of it, this uh, line of conversation that we've been having is actually quite good, considering so many people are new to your channel. Yeah. No, that's true. I mean, I'm, I'm enjoying, you know getting to know a little bit more myself, but I'm sure uh, I think it's mostly everyone else is. Introducing Batbeard. I don't <laughs> actually know how much I've I've talked about, like, shit You've that I'm into. Quite a bit more than I think even, well, it's about equal, but more than you might think. Yeah. Uh, now, one of my, uh, one of my biggest failings with uh, discussing with people, or talking to people is I never ask, ask questions. Shell always is on my case about oh. it. It's like, you never ask questions. And then my brother is too, and I'm like, I, gu I guess if I have two people telling me this, I need to ask more questions. Okay. And then it's actually, like, yeah. weirdly obvious now when I'm talking to, like, other people. Like, uh, I, I ran into some friends that I hadn't seen in a long time, and I was asking them questions like, you know, hey, how, how are things? How, uh, uh -huh. How's this? So on and so forth. And they just, like, gave me a couple of answers, and then it just, the conversation would lull, and I'm just like, Aww. Oh, I get it now. This is why, this is why conversations are, are, like, a thing, effectively. And it was, <laughs> yeah. okay, here we go. I think, I think I finally got it, uh, except for we have a bunch of random floaty bits that might need fixing over here. Why don't we... No, mm. my skills are not even there yet with this. I'm trying to. I just want you to tell <laughs> me if it's symmetrical properly or if I fucked up somewhere. Oh, okay. Looks like I fucked up somewhere. I could be wrong though. Wait a second. Do you have I symmetry guess... on still? I I should. Yeah. Tell me if uh, are you looking at the right side? I'm looking at the right side. Yeah, symmetry is still very much on. It's still very much on. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll just fill these out, I guess. Yeah. It, you know, at the same time, it's hard to figure out questions. Oh, yeah. Um, it's impossible. Like, yeah, it's... it's... <laughs> yeah, I mean, I've thought uh, of trying to ask you questions, and uh, I so, get nothing, you know? <laughs> so I'm like, I'm, I can't be all that hard on you for not asking me questions, but at the same time, how do I, like, offer material for conversation? <laughs> You know, I just am not thinking. Yeah. I actually took a bunch of, uh, I was in the improv club uh -huh. in, um, and I, t I took acting classes in, uh, high school. I always found that was kind of useful, but not as useful as, sure. oh no, yeah. what did I do? Uh, oh, Why that's... Why did I do this? Got the wingtip off somehow. How'd that happen? That is strange. Oh, and I'm almost out of oxygen and stuff. Oh, okay. I think while well, in creative mode, they'd let you chill out and not have to worry about oxygen, but I guess <laughs> we're just creative block placement and nothing else. Um, yeah. Alt F10, is there something for... Actually, it doesn't like... doesn't look like it. Were you part of any, like, big student groups when you were uh, in high school or nah? Or college, actually. I was never in any college, high uh, college interest groups, so I was like, eh. Um, I, in I high school, since I was, since I was homeschooled, the only student group that I was oh, a part of was, you were um, Didn't know oh that. yeah, all the way through high school. Wow. And, um, but I, I did get to interact with a classroom online, uh, at age 15, 
It was with the University of Viola, and um, that was nice. That was that was really quite nice. And I I did speech and debate as well in high school for about three years. I and, uh, I did debate, and the entire club decided to disintegrate on itself, and they like asked me uh, to run for president because I was one of the only people that nobody that wasn't universally hated. And I was like, I'm a freshman. No. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, no, I... I... <laughs> Here, run everything. <laughs> it's you or we die. <laughs> that was that's, not... That's I was not, not a big fan of that that uh, setup there. They were... Yeah. That was bad. Yeah, that, that's terrible. But I, I, I enjoyed it. I actually had... Um, uh, the funniest thing is that there was a national tournament that me and my, my partner were debating, and it, the subject of that year was uh, reduced dependence on foreign oil. And um, he had this plan that was um, to basically mandate that all new houses be built with solar panels and so on. And it, it was really great, and at that national tournament, uh, he and I made it to semifinals, and then there are three rounds of finals. We got it to we got to the second to the last round, and it was just a shocker because no one of our age had done that. We were 14 and 15 years old, and we were debating against you know 17 and 18 year olds, and um, it was it was funny because like I got such a swole head from debating that well and having that much success that I was so cocky in the future debates and tournaments that uh, we just fell apart as a team. <laughs> yeah, that would do it. But uh, it was still fun, and I learned a lot uh, from that experience and from from seeing how pride can consume you. <laughs> oh, yeah, it can totally mess up your, your, your mojo. Yeah, yeah. Which, is why, which is why I lean towards humility a lot more. And you, you can't you can't ask me to you know promote myself uh, that highly. I mean I will you know to get a job done to you know do something, but I just don't feel good doing it. Um, you know, and life has taught me that it's it's just so much better not to. Yep. I always feel awkward doing self promotion in any way, shape, or form. It's just yeah. like nope, don't like this. Not gonna do it. <laughs> Oh, it makes it so much easier, but it also does not get me ahead, but whatever. Yeah. Ah, uh, you find you find your own way. Mm hmm. Oh. This sucks. Looking good, it's... Yeah, it's dang. looking good. There's a couple of blocks that are never going to work, and I don't... Uh -huh. I'm not happy about that part. Because I'm trying to do like a exchange between the two block types and it's not working. Mm -hmm. For I'd say obvious reasons. Cause like yeah. you wanna you wanna take a look at what I'm talking about over here in this corner? Uh that cor which corner? Uh that this corner. side over here. Yeah. Okay. So what I wanted yeah. to do is like changed but there's no way that you can have like a, a proper connection part here it's well, just gonna um, be this like awkward slope no matter what I do hold on uh I guess I can always just go for the more jarring one but have the the big thruster yeah um to break up so Cut the corner a different way. There we go. Mm. Got it. There we go. Hate rotation in this game. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I hate it more than you because I can't even do what you do. <laughs> <laughs> with it yet, without a lot of practice and failure. Yeah, it's... That uh, just wouldn't look good. 
But yeah, building projects this big, they're, they're gonna take a long time. And it's not, not like we can magically make it happen faster. <laughs> oh, can you make sure on the other side that I'm not, I haven't like screwed up horribly? No, not at all. It's, it's copying exactly. That's good. Which is nice. What happened before with, I think, I think what you did is you started uh, building off of a piece that wasn't built on this side. Yeah. So it's, it built a ghost part. Okay, so it's not perfect, but it's better than what we had. And I'll take yeah. it. Yeah. 